Hello people and welcome back to another video and in today's video I am going to show you how to install Pixmon Reforged or Generations but in this video I'll just show you how to install uh, Reforged but it's the exact same thing for Generations. I will try to make this video as fast as possible so you don't have to waste uh, too much time as it is pretty easy to install it but uh, but yeah, <laughs> let's begin I guess. So if you click the first link in the description, it will take you to this page, Minecraft Forge, which you need for any Minecraft mod. So if you click the little plus sign right there for 1.12.2, click on it. And I would suggest downloading the recommended, unless you want to just get the latest one. But I always download the recommended and have never had like any issues. And uh, it's just been working really well. And look at that. See, good skin. All right, cool. <laughs> Uh, if you have Windows, install the Windows installer. If you have anything else but Windows, install the installer, the normal one. While that is installing, click the second link for Pixmon Reforged, click download, or if you want to install Generations, it will be the third link. Click download right there. And of course, if you want Optifine on your Pixmon, I will show you how to do that as well, because Optifine just improves Minecraft in general, gives you more FPS. And, uh, and you can you can zoom in, okay? That's sick. <laughs> so if you scroll down, click on, uh, I mean, find the 1.12.2 section and just download the latest one. So while everything is installing, I've installed it already, but whilst it's installed for you, make sure you have 1.12.2 installed. So just go open up your Minecraft launcher, go in installations, new uh, version, and just go down just a little bit, find release 1.12.2, click on it click create for some reason i can't get rid of this profile i don't know why it's just glitched but hey let's just ignore that for a second it doesn't actually work as you can see <laughs> so just click play on the profile wait for it to download and open up once you have opened minecraft uh, you can pretty much close it you, you just have to open it up to successfully install it i guess and uh, and yeah just close the game once you have successfully installed and in, uh, downloaded the mods double click on forge and make sure installed client is ticked and your uh, like folder place where minecraft is installed for me it's the default place which is that uh, just click ok once you see uh, successfully installed the client just click ok there and uh, <laughs> go back on minecraft launcher well hey uh, <laughs> And uh, for me, it's it's a bit weird. It's glitched out, but for you, it should be fine. You should have a separate fold. Uh, I mean, profile just like that, uh, where it says the forge. But for me, it's glitched, so I have to do this. Uh, in case you have this as well, actually, uh, click the little three dots there. Edit, release. Scroll all the way down, and it should be release. And uh, if you want to make sure this is the right one, uh, look at the numbers. The last four numbers for this one is two seven six eight. Check the forge one. 2768 so that is the uh, correct one click in it save and play so once you have opened up minecraft you should see a mods tab if you've done everything correctly uh if you open the mods tab obviously you don't have pixmon because you haven't put it in the mods folder just yet but um yeah this just confirms that you have successfully installed forge and you are on your way to play pixel <laughs> so uh you can close down the game now once you've done that go to your search thingy i don't know what's called just search bar i guess type in run uh, click enter or press enter then type in percent app data percent click ok open the dot minecraft folder and you should see a mods folder if you do not see that uh that's perfectly fine you can right click new folder and just rename it mods and click enter it should work but since we already have one and i'm guessing you do as well uh just open up the folder drag in the pixelmon mod and if you want optifine as well drag it in there as well so uh and and yeah that's pretty much it uh let's just go back on the minecraft to confirm that we have installed it successfully so once you loaded up minecraft you can now see we have five mods loaded five mods active which means we have successfully installed Pixmon. Let's go. <laughs> this will be either Pixmon Generations or Pixmon Reforged, depending on the one you installed. But it's the exact same thing. You just drag it in the folder and it should be installed. And if you want to confirm that you've installed Optifine, since it doesn't appear here, uh, you go Options, Controls, go down just a little bit, and you will see a zoom option, which is for Optifine. Um, 
I, it should say C, but I replaced it as left menu, aka alt, the one next to spacebar. Because, uh, <laughs> uh, I don't know, I just prefer it like that. But yeah, that confirms that we have installed Optifine as well. That being said, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I'm not sure how long this is going to be. Hopefully not that long. And, uh, and yeah, hopefully you successfully installed your preferred version of Pixelmon. And, uh, and yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye!